In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to create a hanging indent in Microsoft Word, perfect for setting up your documents for citation formats like APA or MLA. Let's dive right in and walk through this simple process together, ensuring you get the formatting just right. First, we'll need to access Microsoft Word, and the good news is you can do this online for free if you don't have the software installed on your computer. To begin, head to the free Microsoft 365 online webpage. You'll be able to access Word and other Microsoft Office products right from your browser with no installation needed. Once you're on their webpage, look for the sign in option. If you already have a Microsoft account, simply enter your credentials. If not, don't worry, setting up a new account is a quick and easy process. Having an account allows you to save your documents to OneDrive, which can be quite handy for accessing them from any device. After signing in, go ahead and click on Word. This will open up Microsoft Word in your browser, ready for you to start creating or editing your documents. Now find a document where you want to apply a hanging indent or create a new one if you're beginning from scratch. With your document ready, look toward the top of the page and locate the layout tab. This is your gateway to adjusting the page settings including the margins, size and indentation. Click on it to reveal a variety of options. To create the indentation, you'll need to adjust the paragraph settings. From the layout tab, move to the paragraph section and click on that option. It might be underlined in the interface making it easier to spot. A dialog box should appear giving you detailed control over your paragraph formatting. In this dialog box, keep your eyes peeled for the indentation section. Within it, there's a drop down list labeled special. Click on it and then select hanging from the options provided. The hanging indent adjusts the first line of a paragraph to align differently than the rest, which is essential for certain styles of writing. Once you've selected hanging, take a moment to set the measurement for the indent. Typically, a 0.5 inch indentation is standard for most citation styles. After making your selection, don't forget to hit OK to apply the changes. And there you have it, you've successfully created a hanging indent. This formatting style is now applied to the selected paragraph, aligning it perfectly for any references, lists or formats you're adhering to. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you have any more questions, feel free to explore other videos and articles to improve your word skills even further. Happy formatting!